All right, let's take a look at our weather now. And we did have a little break in the clouds today with a nice breeze going on, a little burst of sunshine, but we're back to some cloudy conditions now. Carrie Lane is standing by with a look at our forecast. Carrie? Good evening. Yeah, the silver lining in all of this news, right? We finally got to get outside, enjoy some fresh air today. You'll be able to do the same thing tomorrow, but not before we see a storm system move in overnight. Those clouds are going to start to roll back in. That marine layer going to start to deepen, and we are expecting some rain, possibly some heavy rain in our overnight hours. But the good news is it will wrap up by the time most of you are waking up tomorrow. Current conditions along the coast were mostly in the 60s as we push inland. Escondido, Poway, upper 50s. Look at Ramona, a little chillier at 53 degrees. Palomar Mountain, 35. Out in the desert in the mid 60s. We do have a winter weather advisory for our local mountains here. We are expecting a little bit of snow in tonight's storm. Uh, not as much as initially anticipated. Things are starting to slow down and we have much warmer conditions down here in San Diego as that storm makes its way in. But we should still get a light dusting out in the mountains. This advisory will go into effect at 6 o'clock tonight. It's going to expire tomorrow morning and this is for elevations above 5,000 feet. If you want to see some snow, the good news is we have another storm system moving in on Wednesday. That one through Thursday should bring us anywhere from 3 to 6 inches for elevations of 6,000 feet and above. So there will be some snow in the mountains. This is the storm system causing all that rain. It's been bringing some decent rain to Northern California moving into Los Angeles today. It's also bringing some heavy snow out into the Sierra Nevadas. As we get into tonight, we'll see a light band make its way on in through San Diego. This is the cold front here that'll bring us the rain. Again, this is a fast moving storm. Things are going to wrap up rather quickly. This is the more organized storm behind it that will swing in on Wednesday and this was, uh, will bring us widespread showers Wednesday and even in into Thursday and then we should dry out for Friday and Saturday before more rain is on the way. So yes, it is going to be wet for quite some time, but at least we're getting some breaks so we can get outdoors. Here's the storm tonight around 10 o'clock tonight. You can see moving into the North County, even out in the mountains. Some possible thunderstorms may pop up. This will move quickly. This is by Tuesday morning, six o'clock in the morning. You can see we are now cleared out and it is going to be mostly dry. And then again, another storm system will start to creep in as of Wednesday morning, and that will bring more snow to the mountains. I will have your eight day microclimate forecast coming up in just a little bit. But first, guys, we'll get it back to you. All right. Thanks, Carrie. Thanks, Carrie.